Mikey, man, congratulations. So happy for you, so dude. The first you know, American to win two titles, the first American to win two, two different divisions. weight classes, the first American to beat Bruno Malpacino. You made so much, so much history, man. Tell me, how does it feel? What's on your mind? It feels so fake to me because I really worked my butt off to make this weight division. And um, I, I almost, yesterday it was so hard for me to make the weight. Uh, you guys saw me in the videos all over how dead I was. And I regrouped, I came back today, and it was all God's plan. He had me make weight yesterday for a reason. And then I came today and I fought again, and I was able to win again, three years in a row. Can you tell me about the weight cut? How difficult was that for you? It was very difficult. I, um, it was just, I, I really gave it my all. Like, I, I, I was willing to die to make weight this time. I, and I was able to do it because it was a dream of mine to win two categories. And I, now I want to win featherweight also. My goal, I always have new goals, new plans like we talked about. Every year I have a new goal. And I won rooster weight, light feather, and maybe feather next in the future. Not right now, of course, I'm too light for feather, but maybe in the future, you know. You gotta put on some weight. Bulk up with pasta. <laughs> <laughs> awesome, man. What, what's going through? This is a, 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 a long journey for you. What's going on inside? How, how do you feel? Honestly, I don't feel any emotion anymore. Like when I first won Worlds, I had so much emotion, but now it's almost, I, I, expected, I expected from how hard I work, I deserve this. Like there's no one that works harder than me and no one that sacrificed and has as much pain that I've been through in this long Jiu Jitsu journey. And I deserve to be world champion every year. And that's what, uh, it's God's plan. Absolutely, and, and just um, the Bruno Malvasini fight was an amazing match. The whole crowd, I'm not sure if you, if you could hear them, were chanting your name at, at the end. How did that make you feel? It was a very sad fight for me because I trained with Bruno when I was a younger kid and I didn't do the rooster weight division for three years out of respect for him, you know, so um, to ha and then he signed up last second to fight me, so it was very hard for me to compete with him and to keep composed during that ma match because I was very emotional and um, so I didn't really get to enjoy that match too much because I, I felt so bad like competing with him, you know, but um, I'm just so happy and it was God's plan. I made weed and I came here to fight today and three years in a row, I won the Worlds. And just one more, you and Tam Tammy, of course, wins the world title. Honestly, I'm more happy about her winning than me because she deserved it so much. She worked so hard her whole life. Us both drilling with each other every day, waking up before school, 4 a.m. sometimes we'd wake up to drill before school and we both worked so hard and she finally won her black world title in law school barely i barely train with her because she's never training because of school Crazy. and she just won black world worlds today you know so i'm so proud of her and um i'm just so honored to be a part of this journey and we are the first two siblings the same year to win worlds together what does that mean to you it's so big i always dreamed about that when i was younger about doing this with her you know us winning together and it's amazing i'm so thankful for everything and um i just want to thank everyone that supports me and um and everyone that was talking crap yesterday about how i looked dead i was dead but I came back today and I fought. <laughs> awesome. Congratulations, Mikey. Thank you, you so deserve much. it, brother. Thank you. you deserve it, man. Congrats, Mikey.